What is up all you beautiful people? And um, as you can see behind me, the new setup's on the car. So it's really exciting. Um, we've got a bit of a montage of it and a couple of other things that you guys have been asking about. So I'll chuck those in this video too. Other than that, enjoy. <laughs> see Sally's parked up with the boxes on the back looking pretty schmick um, I'll chuck a video in now of me driving it at night so you can see the lights and listen to old mate uh, old mate's whistle <laughs> so after that I'll show you guys how I bolted the canopy to the tray Okay guys, a few of you are asking how I'm mounting the canopy to the tray. So, all I've done, drilled a hole straight through the tray and the canopy. Now, I've purposely gone through one of the rails. It's a lot stronger than just going through a sheet. So, come through. Um, don't do what I did and drill it too close to your mount. Come back a bit so your bolts are straight. Um, the other thing too, just because this is sheet metal on the bottom, it's not actually braced. Um, you can see my wash is just a big flat bar. That's just to spread the load out so that you don't like crack the sheet or do anything. So I've just got four of those. Um, and as you can see, I've also polyurethaned it to try and seal it up in case any water comes up. And if I want to take the bolts out, the bolts will just tear off at the poly, which doesn't really matter. Um, I'll give you another look once the floor's in so you can see those holes that I've cut out, where they go, um, and the whole idea behind that. Also thought it'd be a good time um, to show you guys my spare tire carrier. So. On the inside, I'm going to brace up with a friend of mine to weld me up, just an X. Um, and I've got a piece of M12 all thread going through it. Um, and I've got bolts, yeah, coming through here. Sort of all bolted together. The idea is, again, spreading load because it's only sheet. And I wanted to try and tie it to these IHS. Again, on this side, big plate. Um, four bolts that go into that cross and then yeah just a, a uh, just a, uh, a winder I guess a bit of fun winds up clamps the tire against there also with putting in these big bars um, as you can see I had to re-gut the canopy to put these in so make sure you put them in beforehand to pull them down at least um, if you're doing something similar to how I am by bolting it and you're working with it off the car Put them in first so then you don't have to, don't have to gut it All right, so I've just got the floor sitting in there. I haven't actually screwed it down yet But as you can see I've got my four little holes and the whole idea is You can see the bolt through the hole take it out Plug it back up Don't think I ever want to take the canopy off without gutting the whole inside That's gonna wrap us up for this video let me know what you think of it now it's on the car. If you like it, what you'd change, um, 
And yeah, I want to hear back from you guys what you guys have been getting up to, what you've been building. I'm loving the comments at the moment, um, all the support and the feedback and all the little tips and tricks. So if you guys have watched any of my videos, make sure you go through the comments because there's a lot of good um, tips and ideas on there to help you guys with your projects. Um, other than that, God bless and I'll see you in the next one.